Hello demigods, monsters, and gods alike. This is the Olympus Report. Ever wonder what your favorite demigods are up to? Well, we over here at the Olympus Report and at CHB Updates on Twitter have you covered. Here's everything big and small going on at camp this week. Up first, attention, half-bloods. There is an unidentified monster near the southern border. Today's designated border response team must report to the southern border to provide support. The breach risk is low, but please be attentive of your surroundings and alert for future updates. Up next, half oh, Excuse me. Sorry. Uh, important message from Chiron. We've got a message from Chiron, Half-Bloods. Oh, good news. Please disregard that last update. The monster was identified as a rogue carnivorous sheep. Isolated from its pack, it was easily subdued. All campers may return to their daily activities. Up next camp, it seems we have a prankster on the loose. Hey, is there any particular reason why I woke up with pink hair today? Who did I wrong at the Aphrodite cabin? Or who did I write? Because I'm actually rocking this, not gonna lie. Travis. And in some arts and crafts news, a junior hectic child is handing out homemade friendship bracelets. Please accept and proudly wear the bracelet she gives you. The last two campers to decline were Hex to only speak in riddles. We're still working on a cure, so just accept the bracelet. In some other news, Piper would like to know, can someone explain to me why there's a rap battle happening at the amphitheater? In this week's visitor news, Sally is at Camp Half-Blood, visiting Percy. She decided to stop by on her way home from taking Estelle to a routine doctor's appointment. Will is performing his own checkup on Estelle, claiming that mortal doctors don't know what they're doing. And according to Will, both mortal and demigod doctors have confirmed that Estelle is a beautifully healthy baby. And in some other news for the Apollo kids, bad haikus are not a valid form of weaponry. Well, Half-Bloods, that's all I've got for you this week, but stay tuned for next week. And always remember, until next time, stay safe.